Hey guys, going on here and welcome back to my channel today. In this video, I have yet another strike specific award review for you guys and this one is going to be covering the brand new sniper rifle, the Devil's Dawn. This sniper is a reskinned Shadows of Veils from the House of Wolves and it is actually really awesome. So first off, you guys are probably wondering where I got this weapon. This sniper actually comes from the loot hordes within the Sepix Perfected and the Abomination High Strikes. You do need a skeleton key to open these chests, which you can either get from the strike bosses, or you can get a free one from Shiro 4 after completing the Sepix Perfected questline. The Devil's Dawn features the same body as the Shadows of Veils, but is white and has a SIVA logo on it instead. And from what I have seen, it always drops with the same specific perk set. And from what I have seen, it always drops with the same specific perk set. In the first tree, you have a choice of either Linear Compensator, Accurized Ballistics, or Field Choke. Personally, I always go with Linear Compensator, but the choice is really yours. Then you have the Life Support perk. Then in the third tree, you have the choice of Armor Piercing Rounds, Rifled Barrel, or Quick Draw. Again, personally, I use Rifled Barrel, but both of the other perks are great choices too. And finally, the Sniper rolls with the Firefly perk. I would also like to mention that it automatically has the intrinsic perk Disciplinarian, which makes it do a small amount of bonus damage against Fallen. So as you can see from the gameplay in the background, this sniper is definitely meant for a PvE role and performs very well in this environment. It really only has two main downfalls, and those are that it only has three shots in the magazine and you can't switch from its default scope. Other than that, this is an amazing gun. It has the impact of a black spindle, so it definitely has some stopping power. So if you are under fire from enemies and you manage to get a kill off, then more than likely you're going to get your health back. And then Firefly is really good for killing big groups of enemies. Now in the Crucible, it is still a viable option as it can be absolutely devastating to people, especially when they are in their supers because it has the potential to one-shot the supers with maximum armor. Like I said, there are definitely better snipers to take in the PvP, but this is still a great one. I would recommend just taking this in to PvE missions and strikes and stuff like that. It is a great sniper rifle and performs very well. But that is the Devil's Dawn. Now, if you would like to see a video of me opening 10 Radiant Treasures, you can click the annotation on screen. If you guys did enjoy this video, please take the time just to leave a like rating and share this video with your friends. It really does help me out. And finally, subscribe for more awesome Destiny content. And I'll see you guys in my next video.